the Kremlin shakes. The giant attack burns down the Russian Aviation Institute in Moscow, Russia and Ukraine war. A fire broke out at the Russian Aviation Institute in Moscow yesterday afternoon, when the war between Russia and Ukraine was extremely tense. A fire broke out at a famous aviation institute in the Moscow region not far from the Kremlin. This is the latest Russian fire that has been shared on social networks. The fire was described as an attack, with Russian authorities blaming Ukraine for attacking their facility, but offered no concrete evidence. This is the largest fire in Russia, it has a great impact, causing panic among the Russian people because the location of the strange explosion is close to the Kremlin. It is also a disgrace to Putin, showing how weak Russian security is. Footage showing smoke rising into the air above trees produced by the Central Aerodynamics Institute, TSAGI, in Zukovsky in Moscow. According to RIA Novosti, the Moscow regional branch of Russia's emergencies ministry said the fire broke out at a substation at the local aviation institute at around 9 a.m. local time on Thursday. The fire continued to spread to the entire building of the Aviation Institute, the giant fire lasted until the end of the afternoon. The local Aviagrad Zukovsky News Agency posted footage of the fire covering about 22,000 square meters. Other V-Contact users posted pictures of the fire. Severe fire at the substation in TSAGI. The transformer is on fire next to the building, because at that time, the building had not yet been spread by the fire. The institute has been a state research center since 1994 and its website describes it as the largest scientific research center in the world. The cause of the fire is still under investigation. People around here said, we heard many loud explosions after the fire appeared, this must be due to an attack, the entire aviation institute was burned down until yesterday evening. Rodonetsk. Russian authorities repeatedly blamed Ukraine for doing this, but they were unable to release video of the attack.